Right, we're on our bikes again. Oh, it's hard work biking roads Scotland. Whew. Anyway, we're on a, the Buckingham for Martin a old railway line cycling here from Stricken to see how far we can get. Mormon Hill communication masts. We just saw the white horse carved out of Mormon Hill. Well, now we have the stag. The Great for Martin and Buchan railway line. I often think of the railway railwaymen who built this this line. And I'm so thankful because although it's not a working railway line, that it is open for a, for walkers and cyclers like ourselves. And the many times that that we've cycled up and doing this line, it's just just great. Well, you know, cycling out and about isn't always easy. You could be twiddling along and all of a sudden you get caught in a dune pool like this and you think, oh, right, okay, we need to duck for a cover. But I remember once we were out and about, God, we were in the middle of AY, and this was your, your nightmare. There's the two of us, obviously, there's always two of us cycling together. Um, and you know what? Our bikes both had punctures at the same time, exactly the same time. Now, that was a bit problematic, wasn't it? <laughs> Okay, spick in the Doric. Well, it's a bit difficult for me to spick in the Doric because I'm not really sure what exactly the term Doric means. Me coming from a little village called Cruden Bay, which is in the area of Buchan, I think that I speak more with in a Buchan tongue, where you can hear it coming straight from the back of my throat. And it's quite a, a roch, roch sound. Where does that come from? We'll have to do a wee bit of research on that. Speak to you later. Here's an interesting sight. We just spotted a robotic lawn mower. My gosh, we're being tenure, tenure by robots. It's got a life of its own, that thing. For the boot. Well, we didn't quite mark a brocky day, but we decided to come back and see if it there wasn't stricken. Stricken in Buchan, one of our favourite places. This is my fan club, they keep following me. Gosh, come on then lads, come on.